This is going to be a short review on the ZTE Grand X Max 2. All right. It's going to be a um, short review after having it since well, Friday with today is Sunday. About two days, two, going on three days of use. And um, I want to tell you guys that this is a great phone. You can't really see it. It's kind of like I still got like kind of low lighting even in this room too. I got to put some new bulbs in so I won't have to use my um, light for my phone. And I recorded with the Samsung Galaxy J7. So, okay, let's let's get started, man, with the display. Um, display is awesome. This display is really good. It's a really great display. Let me try to focus in so you can see. You really got to have it in front of you because the display is phenomenal. It's awesome. Okay. Um, it's just a great... Do you, do you see this display? It's really great. It's a great display. The phone is nice and loud, the speaker. It's nice and loud on this phone and everything. Like, And um, it's just a great phone, guys. The ZTE Grand X Max 2. It um, comes with a 3400 milliamp battery, non-removable, which is fine with me. Um, it got two cameras on this joint, man. The cameras on this joint is like, it's, it's, it's beautiful. Like, um, let me see if I got some pictures in. I probably got some pictures in here from the other house when I move. Uh, let me see. Hmm. I know I'm sn snivering, sniffing, because I don't know what my nose. Um, let me see here. Like some pictures. I just messing around, <laughs> taking like these crazy pictures and stuff like that. But um, let me see, like like this. I took a picture right here, and uh, like a low light and room, and it's just it, it just take wonderful pictures, like. Can't really see because my, because of the screen. You can't really see it, but you, yeah, you basically gotta have a phone in your hand, stuff like that. Um, but uh, man, like far as like, and I'm not on Wi-Fi. I'm on like regular LTE. Got a couple of bars or whatever. Um, it's it's pretty still pretty fast like. For it to just have like two bars, you know what I'm saying? You probably can't really hear it, but probably can't really see it as good as I can. But but I'm telling you, man, this is it's great, man. It's, this is like really a great phone, man. Like. And one thing I want to tell you about this phone too also, you can um, use your SD card as your internal storage. Boy, that's a beast. For the price of $200, this phone is definitely a steal. It's definitely a steal. It's, um, it shoots full HD 1080p and... Man, it's it, it's a great display. You really gotta have it in your hands to really see how great it is. No lagging. The only thing that lags is like sometimes the rotation. Like when you turn it, turning the phone to the side, sometimes it don't wanna, it don't wanna respond. But other than that, it's a great phone. And I'm not gonna give this phone the thumbs down because of that. Because it has so many other great features. Like just so many things you could do with this phone with this big six inch display. Super is. I'm about to say super omelet, but it's um it's, it's super it's it's HD high definition like full HD, and it's it's a great great phone like I mean the gaming like I downloaded my um 2K16 NBA 2K16 and I'm telling you man like on every device I played that game on it lagged so bad it was it was so slow and man it's so fast on this phone man. With this octa-core processor, man, I think it's like um, McGee is like a um, 1.4 gigahertz of octa of it was an octa-core octa-core processor, man, it's a fast fast phone, fast gaming, 
I mean, everything on this phone is incredible, man. Videos look so crispy. It looks so clean. It, it's just great, man. It's, this is a great, this is a steal. This is definitely like a flagship device for, for the ZTE. ZTE definitely stepped their game up with this one. And I'm not a big fan of ZTEs. I mean, I actually had the ZTE Grand X Max Plus. And that phone was all right, but it was a lot of things I didn't like about the phone. Like, you know what I'm saying? It lagged a lot. You know, but I guess it was okay. But this one, the ZTE Grand X Max 2, man, this is a great phone, man. I mean, the it's just the display and everything you do on this phone is just it's just awesome, man. It really is. This is really an awesome, awesome phone. Like, man, I swear. This phone is great. This is a great phone, man. I mean, I'm I'm telling you, like. Like, no lagging whatsoever. Like, it's just, it's great, man. You know what I'm saying? It's a great phone. It really is, like. And, um, you can get it for, like, $199 with Cricket. And I I got the, um, the $70 plan with Cricket. And, um, which is the unlimited high-speed data. And, man, it's, man, it's awesome. I'm thinking about actually switching from, um, Metro PCS to Cricket, man. I'm really thinking about switching. Even though I, I, I did pay my bill also with um Metro PCS and Metro PCS give me all bars in my new home that I'm in right now. But with um with cricket it only give me like two, maybe three bars with ZTE and it's still fast. So I can imagine if I was in an area with all of the bars, it would be extremely fast. And yes, it's faster than I mean, my Metro is faster than the Cricket, but still, I still want to switch just because of this phone. I'm really thinking about switching just only because of this ZTE Grand X Max 2. Because everything, this phone is what I wish the J7 was. And we're going to have a comparison video on that. But, a comparison video, but, and we're going to, um, I'm going to put this phone up with a few of the devices I have. Because this right now is by far probably the best device that I ever had. The ZTE Grand X Max 2. I mean, I understand. Yeah, I got the Samsung Galaxy Note 2 and all of that. But I don't even think that's better than this. The ZTE Grand X Max 2. I think this is the best phone for real. And especially giving me the option to use my um, SD card as my internal storage. All you got to do is turn the device off. And um, take the SIM tray out and put your SIM card in, put it back in, turn the phone back on. And it's going to give you the option to use your SD card as your internal storage or just use it as, you know what I'm saying, to just transfer your apps and stuff. You know how that go. But it's great, man. That That's great. You can't do that with the J7. You can't do that with the Stylo. You understand what I'm saying? You can't do that with the Stylo 2. And these are all budget phones. But you can do that with the ZTE Grand X Max 2. I mean, without having to root the device and all of that crazy stuff, you can just straight up do it fresh out the box. And it runs 6.0.1, which is the latest Marshmallow. Man, this this phone is great. And this is going to be a short review because I'm really not finished playing with this phone. Like, But, man, the battery life whew, is incredible. The battery life is really incredible on this phone. See the 6.0.1? Yeah, man. The battery life is just incredible on this phone, man. I, I I just can't believe, I just can't believe like how incredible this. Like I don't know, I can't play the game. It's stupid, but but yeah, man, it's incredible. This phone is incredible. I love this phone, man. Like, and I you know when I first I got the um Samsung Galaxy J7 with um Boost Mobile, I spoke a little too fast on that phone because like I said, that phone is still a great phone to me. To me, that phone is still a great phone, but. It did run extremely hot with heavy gaming and watching videos. Oh, my God, it ran extremely hot. You would think the phone about to set on fire how hot it ran. But, you know, and I got another video comparing that Boost Mobile version to the um, Metro PCS version, which is the one I'm recording with right now, man. And I'm going to tell you like this. It's a big difference. It's a very big difference. So, guys, man, stay tuned, man, for the review for the... um j7 as well and, and um and stay tuned for the full review of the j7 and a few full review of this phone right here the zte grand x max 2 beautiful phone beautiful phone and i'm gonna share more light 
I just, you know what I'm saying, need to play with it a little more. But, but man, this is an awesome phone for $200 right now with Cricket $199. And then if you throw the $70 um, plan on top of that, man, pff, you got you a great phone. I guarantee you, man. This, man, you you can do every, any everything with this phone. This, this is, well, I'm going to put it like this. For me, this is the one. For me. I don't know about for everybody else, but for me, this this is the phone. This is it. ZTE Grand X Max 2. Stay tuned for the full review, guys. Peace. I'm out.